In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to create an image classification neural network in under three minutes and in four easy steps. I'm going to walk you through exactly how to download the TensorFlow Docker container. We're going to download our training data, which is going to be a bunch of images. We're going to train the neural network, and then we're going to run a prediction on some novel data. This approach uses something called transfer learning, and it utilizes Google's V3 inception network. It's incredibly fast and it's very, very accurate. Get ready. Okay, so just to reiterate, we're going to create an image classification neural network. And in this example, we'll create a program that can determine the breed of a dog when we feed it an image of a dog. We'll be looking for the two breeds, uh, German Shepherd and Dalmatian. So the first thing we want to do here is download the TensorFlow Docker container. And we can do that with this command here. This will both download the container, uh, the image, and it'll also stand it up in the background. So if I do Docker images, I'll see that this image is now here. It is right here. And then if I do Docker containers, I can see this container is right here, and it's been standing up for 10 seconds. So now we can log into that container and do our development within that container. But before we do that, we want to now download our training data. So I have an extension here that is in the description and you guys can um, download the extension. And the extension allows us to download images from Google search. So I'm just going to search German Shepherd. And we're going to grab a bunch of images of a German Shepherd. Okay, and now we're going to do the same thing for Dalmatians. So now we have one directory called Training Images, and within it, it has the categories as the names of directories, and then in each of these, it has all the images that we're going to train our model on. And I'm going to copy that directory into my docker container. So that's pretty easy, it's just docker cp and then we pass it our standing container id colon forward slash. So that just copied our training image, uh, our training data into our docker container. So now I'm going to actually log into my docker container so I can do my development. So now I'm in my TensorFlow Docker container. So if I go to root, I can see I have TensorFlow, I have the Jupyter Notebook, and I also have my training data, you can see right there. So this command will create um, these files here. So the final step here is for us to get some new images and actually run them against our trained model. Okay, so let's test the, Dalm the toy Dalmatian image against our, our model. So this last parameter here is just going to be Dalmatian toy. Let's see what it says. So it rated the Dalmatian as 0.9997, so almost 100%. So that's pretty good. And then let's try the German Shepherd toy. Same thing, almost 100% accuracy. So you can see you can create a very powerful image classifier leveraging this approach. Thanks for listening.